Hey friend, as uh, December is rapidly approaching, that's going to be the end of the 10th year of creating and uploading videos to this YouTube channel, 10 years. And I find myself reflecting on the over 450 videos that I've created and uploaded to this channel and wondering, uh, has it all been worth it? And what am I gonna do next? This train is ruining my audio. Now 10 years, that's a seriously long amount of time. And you better believe I'm not gonna let a milestone that big go by without some serious celebration. So we have planned, we have saved the best upload schedule of the entire year for December. We're gonna be uploading some of my favorite videos that I've made in a really long time. So I'm gonna be giving stuff away in the comments of every single upload this month. I'm kind of excited about it because I love giving stuff away and it's gonna be in the first hour of every upload. So make sure you got those notifications turned on. We're gonna be launching some some special new merch this month too. We're doing, we're doing a bunch to celebrate and you may be asking yourself, is the title fully clickbait then? And uh, it's not. And I'm gonna tell you about that next after I salt your palate just a little bit with what we have in store for you coming up next on the channel because whoo, I'm excited. I hope that uh, got you a little bit excited. And I wanna clarify, you're seeing some slacklining footage there and maybe you're asking some questions and I've got some answers to give, answers that are coming on December 7th. So we are launching a teaser. I, I just wanna be very careful here in how I do this, uh, this December uh, 10th year anniversary. So in, in December, we're gonna be launching a teaser for some slacklining episodes that are coming up. And I want you to mark your calendar for that date when it launches because we're gonna do something special around this launch and I'm gonna ask you to get involved in supporting helping make these happen. So, okay. This is Editor Levi in the future. We had originally planned to have this video go live on December 1st and to have the entire month of December be the celebration of our anniversary and we were gonna call it membership month. And I'm realizing I don't really do a great job of explaining any of that. And then with the flooding that happened in November, I toyed with the idea of just, I didn't, I didn't wanna do this. Uh, so we pushed it off and I was second guessing it, but now we're, we're going to, we're going to do it anyways. And I'm just, I'm realizing I, I made it just a touch more complicated. And so let me explain my intent real quick. Uh, earlier this summer, we came up with the idea of doing a membership month and the goal was to celebrate our channel members and say, thank you. And to share with the rest of the viewers of the channel that, Hey, these videos are made possible by our channel members. And we just wanted to have a bunch of awesome videos go up in December. And then we also wanted to invite and incentivize and give people a good reason to also join as members. And so that's what I'm doing here with the Slack life series, where we're going to have a trailer go live uh, on Friday. So this is the actual date. You can actually mark your calendars because we've changed it a bunch of times on this date for a 24 hour window everyone who becomes a member prior to that and on that day is going to get a special gift. And that was just, I don't know, I wanted to create a reason to incentivize people to join as members and the members are going to get the first screenings of the episodes. And I realized that I made it more complicated than I needed to in my explanation here. So all you really need to know is that for the next 30 days, we're celebrating membership month where I say thank you to our channel members. I upload some awesome videos give stuff away in the comments of every video and also invite people to become members to support uh, some future stuff we have going.
that's what's going on. I mostly in this video want to say something that I don't say enough, and that is that is thank you. Uh, if you joined in in this past week, or if you started following 400 videos ago, at any point, if you hit that subscribe button and decided to, to see from my goofy face again, I appreciate you. And if you started following along in those in those early days where I was just experimenting with my camera, doing cinematic tests, and then doing my first DIY videos, onto the days where I was trying to become uh, a professional cover drummer, which thankfully moved on to filming mountain biking, sometimes with my tripod filming myself in the forest or other local riders, and then going on to events and filming at actual mountain biking contests from being down in Jamaica, filming some of my first time lapses, which just absolutely blew my mind. Up to those first experiences of sailing on a tall ship for the first time and falling in love with sailing as an adult. until meeting Spencer one day at a park slacklining, a day that changed the trajectory of my career, and he convinced me that living in a van is totally possible. I bought a van, moved in, made my first film about slacklining. Spencer went on to set a free solo world record. Absolutely incredible, just still just blows my mind to this day. to actually getting married to the love of my life, Danelle, and then proceeding to travel in said van. You stuck with me through the ridiculous series of videos where I tried to learn how to run so that way I could actually go on a run with Casey Neistat. through multiple stages of various conversions as we saved up and finally made version 2.0 and got to drive that thing up to Alaska. Bringing about the birth of my first kid, Ember, and proceeding to figure out what does it look like to be someone who's trying to make stuff and live out my values as a father in real life while also trying to make videos about family trips and traveling and leading to the big surprise of our second kid. Two kids in a year and a half. Wow, that just, uh, that turned our whole life upside down in all of the best ways leading up till now. Through all the years of random DIY videos and chaotic adventures, here we are. And I have to say, looking back to the teenager version of me when I started out on all of this, this was my dream. To have a sandbox, to have a place where I could just make videos and have there be people who are interested in seeing them. That was that was what I wanted. And and to be living that out month to month is just it's just wild to me. This entire video journey so far for me has been a solo endeavor, at least on the video creation front. We all know my videos are so much better with Janelle in them. Uh, but the actual making of videos is, is like entirely my thing. And I'm grateful that I've done it. I'm grateful that I built a small production company that specializes in adventure videos. And it was me doing all of that stuff alone. Uh, the big reason being, Partly, I didn't want to end up running a company that I didn't want to keep running. So I didn't want to be responsible for anyone else if I decided to change my mind. I didn't want to go, you know, end up building a production company that had five people working for me and doing work I didn't want to do. I wanted flexibility. I wanted to be able to travel. And I knew, I knew about four years ago that I was personally holding myself back from doing more particularly because one person can only do so much. And that became so much more obvious, especially as we moved towards looking, what, what would it even look like to start a family together with kids? How's that gonna go? Uh, because I, I do this video thing so much and it takes so much time. And uh, 
So I quit doing it solo. This past year, the entire year, I had help. I had help with all things video from Nick. Uh, Nick is someone that you've seen on the channel occasionally. And for me, this was intimidating, especially in the early months of working with him as we moved into trying to figure out a workflow together. And it was kind of like everything I feared. It was more work than I thought trying to get someone involved in what, was, what only existed inside my head. And so I had to grow as a person. I said at the beginning of this year that I wanted to focus more on human being, not human doing. And that meant working less. And that was hard for me to do because I, I enjoy doing video, but being able to spend more time with my kids and my family and actually be present in a way that I could only have dreamed of earlier because I worked for myself and I could be around in the home environment was, was really special for me. And that was, uh, that was made possible by no longer trying to just do it solo. So that's what I wanted to say going into the last month of our 10th year. The sentiment being, I guess, I guess we're just getting started. Uh, I don't, I don't need the channel to grow more. I've said this multiple times. I don't really care about the subscriber number thing of YouTube. Uh, it's helpful because it makes more money for the channel and it makes these videos more possible and all of that. But the only milestone I ever had my my heart set on was getting that silver play button at 100k, and the fact that there's thousands of you that watch these uh, these uploads is just, it's awesome. So I appreciate you. Thank you, and I'll catch you in the next one. Remember, life's better when you make stuff. Peace.